Welcome to the East Point Systems Training Series. In this video, we will show you the new features and improvements to existing functionality that you can look forward to in version 1.3 of FieldCom.net. There are two new items in the Company Preferences screen. The first is a drop-down that causes FieldCom to automatically update the paperwork received to date on work orders when results are received from a vendor. If you select First Result from the drop-down, FieldCom will only update the paperwork received to date the first time results are received. If the vendor sends a second set of results for a work order, the date won't be updated. If you select every time, then every time the vendor sends results to you, the paperwork received date will be updated. If you select never, then FieldCom will never update the paperwork received date field for you. The other item is the cap orders radio button. This lets you know how your vendor caps are currently set. You are able to adjust the vendor cap method in the vendor's setup screen. The Vendor Ranking and Automatic Order Assignment feature within FieldCom has been updated in several key ways. When you first open the Ranking screen, you will notice that the screen has a new look, which displays all of your vendors and their regions at once. In order to make changes to a particular region, select the region from the Regions drop-down. You can then add a vendor, remove the highlighted vendor, or update vendor caps as required. A new addition to the Vendor Ranking screen is the ability to cap a vendor's orders by region rather than with a global cap. With the global cap method, which FieldCom used previously, a vendor's cap was applied across all regions that they worked in. If a vendor worked in multiple regions, and in one region they received an influx of orders that matched their total order cap, orders in additional regions could go unassigned. Now you can assign individual, independent caps per region for each of your vendors. To activate Ranking by Region, click the Cap Orders by Total in Region radio button. When this is clicked, a new screen will appear, which will assist you with the migration process. This screen will show you the vendors that belong to multiple regions, all of the regions that they belong to, their former total order cap, and also their current region cap. When migrating to cap by region, FieldCom will automatically divide the existing total cap across all of the vendor's regions evenly. You can then adjust the cap for each of those regions independently to suit your company's needs. You can browse through the vendors by clicking the Next button, and when you're finished, click Finish. The Inspection Invoice Wizard has been enhanced to give you more power over your inspection invoicing procedures. You can now sort your columns by clicking on them, just like you can with any of the other grids inside of the FieldCom.net program. You can also filter the columns. For instance, if you wanted to filter by managing user, you can now do so. You can also make use of the Replace button functionality to easily replace values in a bunch of columns. If I want to replace the number of photos on all of these rows, I can highlight them, click on the Replace button, type in the number of photos that were taken with all of those inspections, and then click OK. And that has been added to the columns on all of those rows.